Welcome back and we know now which enemy type has which elemental weakness. There's a list of that of course I'm gonna link it down below. But I'm gonna go through each enemy, show them to you in the game. And well, so you can go onto more than just pictures. I will leave some of them out of course like the Cyrano Dante. Yeah, and I'm gonna read through them, that's gonna be the biggest struggle for me. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. We're gonna start with the Dementulas, which has ice damage, or is weak to ice damage, which is pretty much the first enemy you face in the game. Those little ones up there, those are the Dementulas, or well, I call them spiders. Even though they're more grasshoppers or... Uh, go to San Peter in them. Don't ask me what the English word for that is. They give you a hard time in the beginning of the game, that's for sure. But those ones, especially this one, I don't know why he's so much stronger than the rest. Well, not anymore, he isn't. Yeah, those ones. Next to the Cannib Dice. God damn it, I'm uh, gonna have problems with that. The little dogs, I call them. Apparently poison or acid is their biggest enemy. Two-legged little dog, carnip ties with poison apparently. Yeah, okay, that does damage. That does damage. I gotta agree with that. And Next on our list are gonna be the fire dudes over here. Even though I kinda like to shoot them with ice too. 48. He actually hit me. That's good. Yeah, but poison is effective against him. Apparently. Enduvians. It's the next uh, enemy you face in the game. It's pretty much... Well, it's not quite in the order which you braid through. But it's the fire spitting dudes, which is spit fire. Apparently, they're weak to acid too. Here we have the Dovian with poison damage, even though, as long as you got range for him and can keep your distance, they're pretty much useless, anyways. Whoop! I mean, like I said, I'm drilling through him with ice too. When I can get him into my scope. Here you can see a little bit damage difference. 48 to... What was it here? 119. And Dovians, those dudes. Sentinels. The more different version of those dudes. Like the Keepers and the Ancients. So I'm not quite sure if that's the guys who shoot. I think it's the guys who shoot. Yeah, they are weak to fire. I used my MG driller mostly for them in the beginning. Here we have some sentinels on the left and ancients on the right. I'm pretty sure. Let's get rid of the sentinels first. Those shoot me. Yep. Gotta burst the bubble first. He actually hit me. Those are pretty much the ones that come at you shooting with their shields up. Oh, it's one with the sword. That's a different one then. I mean, they're kind of hard to see the difference between. Then we got here an ancient, which poison should do the most. Uh, no, I don't see it. Uh, I actually am not sure about that. The two swords meant to be ancient. And those yeah, sentinels of sentinels are pretty clear to me what they are. 
Well, what they are. But the ancient and keeper difference ain't that clear. There's a side room somewhere here. Here we are having another room of confusion. One of them has red eyes, the other one blue. Those guys kind of confuse me. I know there's a desert place where I'll probably also are a few different ones. That doesn't seem to affect him. Fire. Fire it is for me. That also didn't seem to affect him very much. Yeah! I'm gonna go to the fire blaze next. Desert blaze. And see there. If I can tell the difference then. Because right here, right now, no chance of telling a difference. Let's see if I can find some keepers here, because I'm pretty sure this is the place. That's an ancient. Okay. That's an ancient. Whoa! That's an ancient too, right? Damn, I'm eating damage here. Oh, they even listed the ones I just faced and killed. Oh, that's why I'm doing this list, because it confuses me already. Found the keeper! Found the keeper! And he I have no clue what the damage against him is. I'm just guessing fire. But some middle in combat right here. That's a keeper. What a keeper! I wouldn't keep him. Yeah, it's a little bit mixed up, but keepers are definitely those guys. I guess the rest is a mix between sentinels and ancients. For the sentinels, I'm also sure that's a keeper for sure, though. He jumped me already. Bad sentinel. Blue shield or sentinels. Unless they're not. <laughs> Unless they're not. There's one over here too. Let's try my laser poison gun out with him. 70. No, I doesn't drop the shield fast enough. 70. Oh, hey, dude. Thanks for taking your time sneaking up behind me. I haven't even looked what does damage against the keepers because I got jump scared by them. I mean, I would say poison ain't doing that much more than fire. Yeah. Keeper sentinels and that stuff is kind of weird. Mixed up. Cattle worm. Eyes. That's the big dude, the big worm dude who spits acid at you, he's an acid spitter. Therefore, apparently everything that spits acid is weak to ice from what I've seen and got out of this. Mostly, mostly. He's gonna be our cuddle worm, who just needs a little bit of cuddling. Which is weak against ice. I mean, I'm that strongly leveled up 70 against 53. It's full auto. Uh, I feel like mostly it doesn't really matter what you shoot it with. But most enemies, with most enemies. Especially if you got strong guns like the Pito Plasma and the Nikki Boom Boom. Maybe with the weaker guns, it matters more. Yeah, he apparently against the ice. Feronite, the flying dudes. In my opinion, they're weak to everything. But as it is, apparently, um, the Soren rifle did a very good job with them. Just as good of a job like, yeah, every other gun, apparently. Fair nightmare, fair night. The nightmare isn't 
the big boy from them. Ice, even though I'm pretty sure. Yeah, yeah. They are pretty weak, so everything does good damage against them, to be honest. Except for fire, maybe. But I'm gonna find them in the game, don't you worry. Here on top, we have three dudes with no elemental weakness. You can't kill. You cannot kill the Tyranodonte and the Ghost Drillers. I feel like the Ghost Drillers are the ones that drop in and are on your side. The Warmingus. I'm pretty sure it's a big earthworm thing. You can kill that. Good clip, right? No. Cat Brevus. To be honest, I have no clue what that is. <laughs> no clue. Ice, apparently. Ice. Hmm. Vernibat, I know what those are, Ice also, yeah it's definitely my weapon of choice against them, even though Nicky Boom Boom takes good care of them too. Next here, Vermin Bats who are weak against Ice, but to be honest, if I have something like a Nicky Boom Boom or a Nicky Fura, it's gonna be Nicky Boom Boom all the time, because well, just let me show you the difference. Yeah, actually that melts through pretty quickly. And here's the Nicky Boom Boom. I guess... If you have overpowered weapons like these and an energy and science build, everything's gonna die quickly. Oh, let me get up here to the next enemy type. Yo, Vermin Bats. So, Vermin Bat and Queen Mob. Both of them are pretty much here in this area. This is the Queen Mob with ice, which is what I definitely used all the time. And this does pretty nice damage compared to... Damage is slow. Compared to Poison. To be honest, if I use the Pitoplasma as a comparison, which is pretty much one of the strongest poison guns, everything looks strong. <laughs> the same if I use the, use the Nicky Boom Boom on him. Nicky Boom Boom is also gonna look strong as hell. Oh, I don't look strong as hell though. Just die. Let's get to the next enemy types. We quat, we quat, we quat, we quat the queen mob, which is, uh, yeah, the small variant of the queen, and the queen, queen is not effective against ice, right? But the queen mob is, where's the boss list on the second page? We're gonna look at the boss list in a second. Zippo kill are the jump scary plants that jump scared me a lot. Those, I hate those. None. You just shoot at them after they jump scare you. Sorry. Here we have a jump scare plant. Let me just show you. Yeah, those ones. I hate them. Quick jump scare plants. So you know how to find them and kill them before they jump scare you. Yeah, jump scare plant. Here we have some chip tools. And make a boom boom baby. Fire or Nicky Boom Boom. Weak against Nicky Boom Boom. Like everything on this planet. They're kind of annoying if you don't have that gun. You can see they're doing ice damage. That's why fire is their weakness. But if you don't have anything else, the Soin Rifle also did a good job with that. Better than the MG Driller, for example. Yeah, yeah. Jyptus. That's a weird name. Fire, apparently. Even though I used ice mostly against them. That's what I used most against the chapters. I feel like the Drill MG didn't do a better job. 
The Nicky Boom Boom does, of course. It's Nicky Boom Boom, baby. It always does the best of the job. Okay, okay. Second list. We got bosses here too. I'm just gonna go quickly through that. So you can see what does damage against who. Nothing surprising except the queen. Because the little ones are effective against ice. And this one against poison. But I'm pretty sure when you fight the queen at first you don't have the resources for a good poison gun. So it's mostly gonna be ice anyways. Yeah. Here we get the... Uh, General and the Tavos Cape, which are both against poison, even though Nicky Boom Boom Baby, of course, always, it always is kind of the best. Salam Keep also poison, I just uploaded a video of that. Lubadia Boys, Boys, Lubadia Boss, we also get an extra video. Ice is the best weapon for him, for sure, just like with those two dudes. Even though poison does also good damage on him and on his little pots that he gets health from, it's fire. Druduvits, I always called them the Jedi or Sith blocking, bullet blocking dudes. Acid and here fire. Even though you can't really shoot both of them. Not most of the times, but there uh, should be short clips of that my favorite enemy madrias the screaming um, like mist pits mist like in dust you scream after you kill them acid really acid hm, that's weird i always look at always use eyes hm, yeah let's test it out everything right after announce the names of them Peace. So here we're gonna have the Madrias boss, where I always used ice against them. Let's test poison. To be honest, I'm probably gonna stick with ice still. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Poison was around 80 and this is 53. I feel like ice slows them down more. And right here, oh, there's one more. Let's test it one more time. I mean, yeah, it does good damage. But I feel like over time, the uh, ice damage is gonna be better. Especially because it kinda slows him down and grips him down. The bar fills up faster, the ice bar fills up faster than the poison bar. Oh boy. Yeah, those guys. And last, but definitely least on our list, we've got the dudes here. I didn't even block him in time. Okay, I got a good hit on him. Which, you're definitely gonna use those combat abilities anyways. He is poison weakness. I've made a video on him already. Let's just ignore him. Oh, I can't ignore him. That's the ice dude. Fire weakness. Damn. We got him pretty good there. Yeah, let me just clean up this mess here. But those two are pretty much the only thing that's left. Unless I can find that one. God damn it. God damn it, there. There, you wanna fight? Let's fight. Let's fight. Please. There you. Oh, we got one of those dudes too. God damn you. Jump scaring me like that. Yeah, that's pretty much the list here. There's one dude I'm missing. I'm not quite sure where to find that white skinny creature. Yeah, he's out. In the meantime, there's a short ending clip coming. We have a big dog here who is not listed. Let's try just a poison. Yeah, poison. 
It's probably the same for him too. He's fairly slow. The rule of thumb here is the quicker the bar fills up, the more element damage it does. If the bar doesn't fill up quick, you're probably using the wrong element. That's my rule of thumb with those kind of enemies. With those kind of enemies. Are you gonna be locked forever though? We will never find out. 